That's what happened, Papa. I and the manager have tried our best, but the amount, the amount the police mentioned for his bail is too much. Imagine 1.5 million naira. Eh? Or oh, he faced tried now. Hey! Calm down, Oppoma. Calm down. Be a man. He'll be released as long as his hands are straight. Don't bother. He'll be okay. 1.5 million naira. Where will such money come from? Papa, just last month, our shop got burnt. And brother, is in those container, eh? Loaded with goods, up to 7 million naira, got lost. Hey! 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 So, my brothers, that's what happened. Since then, when he comes out from one police trouble, he enters another one. Police from Abuja, or Kaduna, or Port Harcourt, or even Lagos, will come and arrest him for one offense or the other, which he didn't commit. A former. But uh, hasn't Ezindu, your son, a lawyer that can bail him out? That is the worst part. Each time his lawyer goes there, they tell him it is not a bailable offense unless he produces times 500,000 naira, a million naira, or even more. My son has sold almost everything he has to free himself from police harassment. And yet, and yet, <laughs> I'm sorry, but I don't see anything I'm using in this matter. Yeah, I'm sorry, no, I'm sorry, please, God. <laughs> so I decided to. I call on you, my brothers. Ezindo is not my son alone. He's also your son. I need 250,000 naira. Yeah? 250,000 naira to bail him out of the police cell now. Afama? Hmm? Diko, italaku no ono koke esegede. Mbana maju, diko italaku no ono koke esegede. No, you want us to bring 250,000 naira from our pockets to solve your personal headache? Eh? Yes, please, please, I'm begging. Hey. I'm pleading. <clears throat> Anything, anybody amongst us here can contribute. Yes, please. Mm. Performer. Oh, yeah. mm. I think you are talking nonsense. Huh? Absolute nonsense. Yeah. When your son was moving around the entire community promising to do this and that, why didn't you come here to tell us that that boy is a criminal? Why? <laughs> My son is not a criminal. Please. He's not a criminal. Then what is he? Let us tell ourselves the truth. That boy came back here. I don't know what both of you discussed. But before we all knew it, you were out there in the community promising to do everything conceivable. Oh. You want to reconstruct all the roads. Mm -hmm. You want to construct boreholes. Mm -hmm. You even went to street corners planting your names there. Oh. You did all that. And while all this was going on, you didn't tell us that that boy is a crook. No, you did not. Mm. You conveniently forgot it. Oh, my name. Yes. Listen to me. As I said earlier, my son is not a criminal. Good. I am very proud of him. Very proud of him. He came back to this village with intention to improve the lives 
of the people. My son is a very, very successful businessman. The only thing is that he's in trouble now. <coughs> Your son is a very, very successful businessman. Fine. Let him take his money and bail himself. That's <laughs> all. I mean, why are you now asking us for money? He's a successful businessman. Mm. Let him come out. Mbadinuju, mm. it has not come to that stage. Mbadinuju, mm. we are here to find a solution to help our son. Okay. Who is in trouble. All right. But before we find the solution, let's make sure we don't end up as accomplices. Oh, former, supposing what the police say about your son is true, what happens? Ofama, tell us. Nze. Uh-huh. Nze. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. If you're not willing to help me, then don't abuse me in my own house. Look, uh-huh. don't. He had the right to express himself. He had the right to tell you exactly how he feels. And let me tell you, Ofama, that son of yours is a very, very ambitious person. Over ambition. And his ambition is not good for him. He promised to give Igwe 1.5 million for his next of father, just so that the Igwe will confer a chieftaincy title on him mm. among all of us here who are elders. Right? Oh, I mean, what kind of son is he? Oh, I bought a Mercedes Benz. Mm. He hurriedly went and bought himself one so that we can be at par. He can compete with me. Okay. Now you want me to use my own money to help in getting him out. You are a joker. Not one cobble will go from me into getting your son out. Um, Ofoma, let me tell you this. There is a shrine in my father's place called Milimamu on your water. If I put one cocoa in this case, that shrine will kill me. Hmm? I'm going. I don't want to die. Go. You can go. Vultures waiting for a cup to drop so that they can feed. Or former. Go! Or former. Go. 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 Take it easy. Go. You can't be a beggar and at the same time quarrelsome. David, do you understand what you are telling me? Isuna. Do you really Isuna. understand? No, calm down. Calm down. I am telling you the truth. What truth, David? Is the what truth? truth? Eh? What truth, David? David. That a 40 feet road container for me 70 million naira, David, just disappeared in the wall, just like that. Impossible, David, impossible. Listen, listen, listen. we are still searching. Searching, we are still searching. Listen, we have been in contact with the shipping agency and the port authorities. We are trying. Mm-hmm. So now, you have been saying this thing, you have been telling me this for the past three weeks now. That is all I have. That is all I have, David. All I have in this world. And this world is invested in that container. Which is just lost in, in the world. Please. Listen. Don't, I don't have anything. Listen, listen. Don't, don't. Listen, listen. Don't forget that I am just a clearing agent. I am not a shipping and, and a sporting agent that handles goods for my blood. I am just trying to. No nonsense. You are telling me nonsense. Get out of my face. You want to go back to that village? You are for people. As soon as something is wrong with your head, what will I do with it? What will I do? I can't run away from my own people. I can't run away from them. As soon as look at us. Look at you and I. 
from a big duplex with all the properties, all the cars, to one room. Just because we went to that same village you want to go back. This was it. One problem. One problem. Today, look at you and I. That is one thing I find it very, very difficult to believe. But that is life, isn't it? I have to move forward. Is it? Let us put the past the behind us. Azuna, that past I will bring back again. Because you see, that our village, that Umuna, it is evil. Everybody is evil there. That is the evil's workshop. Evils are brewed from that place. Oh God, you're right. It's me again. What about the rumors that I heard of him by the uh, What the prophets and divines told me, I know the most of the truth. So I have just one more proof to make. And once that is done, Magnitude will see hell. He will see hell. Yes, Your Highness. The little bird that embarked on a long journey has returned an eagle. Oh. <laughs> the sky is now within my reach. Oh. Yes, I uh, heard you were soliciting funds for the renovation of our palace. That's why I came. Oh, yes, oh, yes. Please sit down. Sit down, my son. Sit down. Your uncle here, Mbadnujo, has been kind enough to donate a whole 150,000 naira. <laughs> Please, Your Highness, return his money back to me. Huh? I will give you 
500,000 naira. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, isn't the my son will always be a child? Igwe, the lamb eats grass. Has it now decided to hunt for meat just to rub shoulders with the lion? Uh, that is not possible. Isn't this my nephew? He believes in expressing himself too loudly. You know he's a young man. I will give you 700,000 for the renovation of this palace. As for the 500,000 he wants to give you, let him use it in tarring that road to his father's house. <laughs> you request for your music. The music you request for is for warriors alone. I do! By the way, why have you decided to hide under the shadows of a castle that never exists? Right. Stay away. For the ocean is no longer for little fishes. Here is a sum of two million naira. One million naira is for the renovation of this palace, and the other one million naira is for you to ask this man to leave. <laughs> Igwe, he lived like Igwe. Isn't it my son? We are both trying to work for the Igwe. We are not fighting, are we? You're a good boy. <laughs> Yourself an ego chicken. Let's see how high you can fly. It is too early for us to do a battle. Uh, There's plenty of time on my nature. Alright. I have come prepared. I see. Just Driver, take my card. Can I go to the market this morning? Get inside. The lion you wounded, that ran away, is back. The elephant you pushed down because it is gentle, has risen in full strength. Madriju, you proclaim yourself the king of this jungle, but I'm telling you to your face that you're nobody. You're nothing but a village tyrant. That's who you are. Evindu. You have the temerity, Ezindu, to point that stick at me. You know, I don't know what makes me think that suddenly a lamb like you has parted ways with its senses. 
What gave you the audacity, the temerity, to dare the lion in his own den? Huh? <laughs> I don't want to hurt you. Go, go, go. You do not judge the moon by its shadow on the ground. Yes. That mistake you, Mbadiju, has made by looking at the shadow rather than the moon. What an elder saw and went blind is what you, a toddler, are trying to see. <laughs> Good. I don't want to. But you are nobody. Mbazinuju, I repeat, you are nobody. Your days of tyranny are over. You cannot put everybody in this village in your pocket. No! The village drum is beating for those who consider themselves warriors to come out and dance. I, Ezindu, I'm already there waiting. I dare I challenge you because the battle line is drawn. I am waiting. Yes, behind a good, good. And then raise the market up uh -huh. in block. That's good. Roofy, partition them into, you know, small, Stop. small stalls okay. and give them out free. And free? Then that will be That's, That's good of you. <laughs> the lamb that jumps about in the jungle proclaiming itself the king of the jungle, must not forget that on the day of the coronation, the lion will be there. Oh yes, it will be there. I feel bitterness <laughs> in your voice, <laughs> no. just, especially in a time like this when the entire village is in a happy mood, mm. rejoicing over what God has done for them through me. I expect that you should rejoice with them rather than want to trade words with me. Uh, or don't you think so? <laughs> no, my son. But you see, a word is enough for the wise. Step aside, my son. Step aside before the gathering clouds descend on you in a storm. Step aside. That gown you are trying to wear, warriors before your grandfathers, we are beheaded in the afternoon. In the broad daylight, attempting to touch it. Just to touch it. And such is the inevitable destiny of fools like you, my son. <laughs> Step aside. You know something, buddy. <laughs> my mother used to have this song she sings. And it goes like this. Onyechia mereze, gaboeze. Whoever God has destined to become king, will certainly become king. Amen. If the entire village has proclaimed me a Zindo, you know what? that's who I am. Amen. <laughs> yes, I knew your mother very well. Interesting little woman. She sang very well. But she taught you the wrong song. <laughs> she taught you the wrong song. You know, Badiju, your tyranny doesn't move me a bit. It is only around your umunda that you can become a tiger, a local champion that you are, a scorpion looking for who to sting. But I will advise you, restrict yourself only to that place because if in your wildest dreams you overstep your boundary, but you, you'll be a dead man. 
I shall become the Owa, whether you like it or not. <laughs> you know, I like young men. They are easily predictable. Now it is clear to me that the goat has mistaken the boil in its mouth for a tooth and has now decided to dare the lion. I accept your greetings. <laughs> I accept your greetings. <laughs> of the lights who have chosen to plan the downfall of an oak tree will come crash I have been insulted right here in my backyard what have I done I demand justice I demand justice Command ten thousand demons of darkness and madness upon you. Back to Sendow. Hey! Give me, give me, give me. 
Yes, can I help you? Are you Chief Mbadiju? Yes. You wanted at the SSS office. For what? There is an allegation against you about the protection of arms. Importation of arms? Yes. Importation of arms. Shall we, sir? To between you and Mba Dinuju. Mm -mm. Mba, or form. If your son to teach that arrogant man called Mba Dinuju a lesson, let him teach me a lesson. Ugoji. Ugoji. Mm -hmm. That man is dangerous. Very dangerous. Papa, relax. You have nothing to worry about. I have come fully prepared. Mba Dinuju is a nobody. A nobody. Jinuju is in the occult. He is implicated in many evils in this community. Can you withstand him? Forget about this issue. Hmm? 
Let's talk about other things, huh? shrine. It's an empty shrine. But the witches are going to, to demand a sacrifice from you. What am I expected to give? The witches demand for one of your eyes and one of your children. One of my eyes? No. I can't give you one of my eyes. I mean, what would I be seeing you people with? Um, I'm willing to give you one of my children and uh, if you insist on something from me then uh, I will also donate one arm so I'll give you one of my arms and one of my children <laughs> the prize is good the prize is good tonight the witches are going to Take the life of Izundu. We are going to chop some meat tonight and drink some blood. <laughs> 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 and make sure you don't fail. <laughs> it is done. What shall we do? Honestly, I don't know. But it is already too late. What we need to do is to, to 
rush him to the hospital early tomorrow morning for proper diagnosis so that they can start treating him. Look at Chief now. It's in a very bad state. Can't we do something on this? He is on medication. We can just let this night pass. Hey, Chief, take it easy. Take it easy. He has even lost yeah. weight. Chief, we have come for you. You're under arrest. Why? It's none of your business. You are wanted on a two-count charge of murder and drug trafficking. Sir, please. Sir, Let's take it before this night. you here for a very important issue. Mbad Nuju here says he has something to tell us. Mbad Nuju. I thank you. Now you're former. I have come to ask all of you here to forgive me for everything I have done against you. I also want to request all of you to beg Ezindu for me. I don't want us to continue with this problem. Otherwise, I cannot be alive to see it end. Ezindu is like a son to me. I don't want this to continue. EJK is Unna. I have withdrawn the case I filed against both of you in the police. Please, forgive me. I never expected that, after what anybody did to me, that I would sit like this with him. Even if I would forgive him, what of the land Aaron Badluji has claimed? I know how you feel. And I'm sorry for everything. I promise all of you here that the land I have claimed, I hereby return to the Umunna. I want all of you to beg this only for me. I want us to end this case we have. 
if I go back to that police cell, I am not sure I will come back alive. <laughs> One sort of shame has come over and upon this umunna, my own umunna. Educationally, we are not there. We haven't been able to produce even a single graduate. Come to the lives of our young men. If they manage to live up to 30 or 35, they are gone. And not to talk of about business. We are neither up nor down. We are just from <laughs> knows all the witches in this woman. Is that right? He has to take an oath right here now that he will never battle, intimidate, or conspire with anybody in this woman again. That's correct. I swear by Amadio that I will no longer do any of these things I'm accused of. I am hereby promising all of you that from now on there will be peace in this community. There will be progress in this community. Forgive him and stop all the battle with him. Your former, I thank you. As in to my son, yeah. thank God, peace and tranquility is coming back in our community. Let us drink and celebrate. Uh, you got it. I think you're right. You're right. Uh, okay, okay. Bring the drinks. We tell my hour. But uh, the only thing there is that. Uh, <laughs> Are you not going with me? Uh, no. You know I was doing something before I, I, I saw you up to this point. Yes. I will go back and complete. Uh, <laughs> uh, one thing I want to advise you. Yes. This morning. Your own share. You mean from that sale yes. of that land? If your own share is enough to complete that building, um, but make sure you complete that building. Don't use it for only a cat <laughs> uh, But I know, um, but you just gave us a little land, took all the millions. What is your concern? You have bought your own share. It's barely enough to buy zinc. Don't worry. <laughs> Mine, I am all right. But uh, you are trying to take a second wife, that little girl. Be careful. They say when the money is there, you can even marry a small girl. Okay, we will <laughs> conclude when we meet at the drinking joint. Okay. Then we can talk more. <laughs> Let me go, man. I will see you later. Thank you. <laughs> Have done this community a great 
good. <laughs> we are very proud of you. We shall give you every support needed in this world. You are the only person who is suitable for Mbadinichu. Money for money, power for power. You are great. Thank you, Uncle. And one more thing, Uncle. I have not forgotten the money I promised you. You will certainly be here for me this evening. Okay. That should be nice. <laughs> that should be nice. Let me go and get more wine for you. I am the greatest tapper in our community. Uncle I make sure you never lack wine for yourself and your friends. <laughs> Thank you, Uncle. <laughs> as long as I'm alive. It's all right, Uncle. I'll soon be back. <laughs> it's all right, Uncle. Mr. Zendo. Chief Ezendo. Yes, what can I do for you? We have a message for you from Umbadi The man you are dragging the power title with. Actually, we came to terminate you because you are no match for him. I came here to tell you you're a fly. A little fly. That's what you are. It is only a child who does not know any way that greets him, Marzi. I have gotten your message clearly, and the contents very well understood. But I'm sure you must be expecting a reply. I am not going to disappoint you at all. I'm already disappointed in you, my son. Very much. Uh, the antelope claims to be a fast animal, but that's only because the lion allowed it to be otherwise. The lion is faster than the antelope. That's why the lion eats the antelope, not the other way around. You disappoint me. Of course you do. Whatever it is you want to go to, I have already been there and back. And I am not excited. No. Not really. Let's wait and see. But before then, I'll give you a little tip of the iceberg. I have an enormous information. Enough to put you away permanently for life to the police. Do you know that? I see information to put me away for life is available to the police. You must have been working extremely hard, my son. For one like you, who is aspiring to be the owner of this great community of ours, I would have thought you would have preferred to do your battles yourself, not leave the police to fight them for you. Isn't that a little disappointing? You amaze me. Oh, yes, you do. You amaze me. <laughs> this is just the beginning. I see. There are more amazing things on the way. Uh, 
Who do you come in for a cola not a Hindu? Just a little piece. There's no point examining a common thief, is there? They don't need to be sent by anybody. They're still all the same. Unfortunately, we never got to find out who did it, did we? We never get to find out who did it. But very soon, very, very soon, no sooner than later.
for all those who in recognition did it fit to honor me with this title. I will, in my financial capacity, and my Lord team, to do and even do more than I've done for this community. Yeah.
when a child steers the hornet of a bee, what does he expect? When a man tramples on a cobra's tail, what happens? Agumba, I'm, I'm not sure I understand you. I'm sure you do. You and those two dead men sold a piece of land belonging to the dead oracle priest to someone else. Yes, but the priest is dead, and he left no son to inherit that land. Yes, but he dedicated that land to the oracle. And the spirits dwell there. Uh, hmm. I can't help you. You are like a small fish in a big pond now. You are on your own. You, you can't do this to me, Agumba. You are my only hope. You won't let me die. All right. I will give you any amount of money. Ah! Leave money out of it. This is no money matter. I don't buy it. Sent to their early grave. Were they not your kinsmen? Oh, but you, you think we are not aware of the atrocities you have been perpetrating in this community? We are very much aware. I'm sorry, he knows that we know. The wicked must bite the dust. It is your turn. Man, go and settle your score with the oracle. Mm. Leave my parents. I said, Leave my parents. But would you leave? I don't want to die.
Tschüss.